Turk knocks on the door, knock, knock, knock. Oh, somebody's at the door. Let's go and see who's at the door. So we all go to the door. Come on. The leash is on. Okay. And I say, sit. And he sits. What a good boy. Okay. Now I'm going to get another piece. So what's he going to do? Step on the leash. Why? Because he can't do anything. I won't go to the report. <laughs> And then all of a sudden he grabs the dog. Now what I like is this. That dog cannot, he can't, he can't jump on dirt whatsoever when he's up to me. He's like, I like the food. <laughs> Maybe I'm a little smellier, right? So then I withdraw. Here's the tips. Don't go too, don't be too close to the door. So you want to do it again? We'll just I'll do what kind of not to do, you know what I mean? <laughs> if we go too close to the door, dirt knocks on the door. Bang, bang, bang. We go to the door. And I open the door like, just a minute, just hang on, I'm trying to hold back. I will tell you right now, when the leash gets tight, it stays tight. And they're puppies, and you don't have much to do with any other tools to get them to go, oh, I'm not going to pull on the leash. They're going to pull, they're going to be excited, and they're going to jump. So where do you want to create success? Girls can do this, and the boys can do this, and the family can do this. If you're home, and the dogs with you are loose in the house, with the leash pump, say it. And then, you pay that. Katie's on her way home. Text him. He's barking. Hey, hey, right? Yeah, I'm not ever. But you started that. You gave barking to me like that. So, when you come home, right, or if you're home, you text, say, I'm coming in the driveway. You can practice with each other. And why wouldn't you make this a five minute or ten minute drill session over and over and over and over? And this is how your dog eats. We'll do it again with, try it with you, right? You didn't seem to care about them. My dog now. <laughs> so, we're chilling. So, the dog jumped at me too. I don't push, I don't push. Nah, I'm sick. Now, I don't feed right away. I'll wait until about five seconds, and now he's five to ten seconds in a moment. I'm working with my dog. Katie knocks the door. Knock, knock, knock. Oh, there's somebody at the door. Let's go see. Now, I'll show you guys something better when I get older. You can teach them to do too. We walk to the door. Oddly, Sit. Good. Stay behavior. That's it. Don't say stay here. Come on in. Now, you can step on the lead if you needed to. Hey, okay. pick that up. Oh, so what? He's a puppy. He's sad. <laughs> I give you the food and you slow him all. Okay. He only learns, or you should teach your dog. When he runs to you, he looks to you and goes, sits his bum down and goes, grab my collar so I can eat. That's what you want to program at this age. Because when he's this big, yeah. <laughs> Trust me. Sit. Okay? So I'm a little close, but we still think success. I would want you to do it sort of back here. You might even say, come on in. Okay? That's the basic of it. It's impossible for the dog to jump. They can't. And when I step on a leash, if you notice I'm stepping on it, I'm not stepping on it tight. He's got a couple inches to move. Why? Because if he wants to jump, he gets this thunk in the back of the head. And it's his problem, not mine. Right? Teach your dog to be in control of their own consequences, the pleasant ones and the unpleasant ones, okay? We don't make as much unpleasant with puppies. They're young and they can't handle a whole lot of stress. But I want them to learn the stress and to deal with it and to become stronger. If anybody ever tells you that stress is bad, tell them, well, you obviously never went to school or went to the gym and tried to work out or, or had a relationship or left the bubble of your house because stress is very, very good. Good things come from diversity sometimes, you know? So I hope you enjoyed this video and that it serves you well. If you'd like more information about puppy training, or any dog training in that matter, then head on over to UnleashedPotential.com. When you head over there, you can sign up for the free video series that I've made for you. You can find an Unleashed Potential trainer in your area, and you can contact us from the website. So thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe, and I hope to see you in another video.